Do you think it's uh, a little irritating that alcohol stores or liquor stores are still open? It can be a challenge for people in recovery to stay sober during the COVID-19 crisis. Now, reporter Lucy May speaks to a young man who walked out of addiction treatment and right into the pandemic. After I graduated from undergrad, I just found myself drinking as much as I did in undergrad. Alexander Christmer says he wasn't progressing in life the way he wanted after graduating from Miami University in 2018. And it just came to an end to where uh, I was sick and tired of being sick and tired. And um, I was just online and I was thankful I found this place and I got in and it was, it was a really good place. It really did a lot for me and happy it came to be. Chrismer found the Center for Addiction Treatment in Queensgate. He went through medication assisted detox and the center's 28 day residential treatment program. He left on March 19th. Before the whole COVID thing happened, I planned on going to tons of meetings and uh, working with a sponsor. Uh, very frequently getting a job, not one to where I was working too much, but something to make it comfortable and make sure my mind stays on track. And obviously that is all different now. Peer Services Supervisor Barbara Walkenhorst says recovery is different for all the center's clients. And for those who are brand new, it, you know, it's a big challenge because one of, one of the major characteristics of active addiction is isolation and self-deception. And now we're telling them to go isolate, but log on to this. And, um, you know, frankly, we're doing the best that we can to keep people connected through to um, recovery connections and then also to our continuing care program. But Walking Horse says that isolation is a big concern. Not everyone is comfortable with Zoom video like what I'm using now. Christmas says the pandemic poses other challenges too. The boredom is what's been the most challenging. I do think it's uh, a little irritating that alcohol stores or liquor stores are still open, but I can't go to a regular doctor or dentist at the moment because of that. But um, it is what it is. I'm going to get through it. Lucy May, WCPO 9 News. The Center for Addiction Treatment has a list of tips to stay healthy and sober during the pandemic. They include such things as forming routines and staying connected to others as well. You can find a link to the entire list right now in Lucy's digital story on WCPO.com.